world was fucking me up. Now I have some free time to speak up about it. What I saw, I liked certain aspects of it, but not all of them. And uh, the bad thing is I'm making like minus right now, but fuck it. That's just fucking life in general is like a big minus calculation. So, um, yeah, what has been happening? Like, a lot of safety schooling. It's about personal protection gear, PPG. And safety measurement. And freezing on a fucking forklift. And, uh, all in all, like, uh, 12? Collected under my uh, cranium. I 
tell you what would happen. My body would say, hey, yo, this is kind of boring. How about you wake up and continue driving on? Like, uh, you make a left or right? Okay, don't tell me, man. Okay, you really can make a left or right. Yeah. The weather is also bad, so there is an increased risk of slipping on the street. And uh, my mother told me today something very funny, like uh, I got her like a new smartphone and a new SIM card and a new number, and I'm doing all this shit new because this old shit, wow, you can't just get around it. Like you have to pay some a little bit, otherwise you will be stuck with other old shit. And it goes on like this, you know? The smartphone is at least like two or three years old, but it's quite functional. And it looks worse than this, and I replaced the battery, and it's newer, faster shit. So, uh, yeah, in case of emergency, because I act like uh, somebody who doesn't care, but at the end of the day, there is, um, I see this is sort of, uh, I fucking hate that word, duty, you know? Like, uh, it's sort of my duty to check that uh, my relatives care for me, in this case my mother. So in this case I sort of have to care, 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 care for her as well. And uh, this is like the minimum obligatory stuff I have to do. The rest I don't care. But this is the stuff where people say I'm good at it, but I'm not really good at it. I just spend more time with it. Like, uh, <laughs> wow man, you can play the piano. No, I just said a little bit more in front of it. Wow, you can like use a computer. No, I just sat around a little bit more than you. This is the main difference. Like people automatically, automatically like assume you're like a pro in something just because you spend more time in it. And uh, I get where this is coming from. Like if you spend one year or ten thousand hours uh, with something, you become a officially like a pro. This is like a sort of one of many guidelines you could like for, fulfill. But still, man, when I look at PC stuff. When I look at the stuff that I don't know, it's kind of fucking weak. You know? I can't write my programs. I don't know what all this code means. I mean, I wanted to get ahead and try this out, but... Because uh, the thing, there's no time for me. Like, I gotta clean up shit now for one or two or three hours. That's basically back to jerking off and going to bed. But you can spend some time and make some music for one hour. You know what one hour of uh, making music is? This is basically just plugging in your instruments, checking the levels, and making sure that you're ready to record. This is uh, what it's like. Uh, even the pros, yeah, okay, they can, get, can, they can get started in five to ten minutes maximum. Because there's such pros and then this routine stuff. But it's all this like, fast, 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 I gotta do, you know, like, this feels so fucking forced. Uh, I hate this, I hate this man. Also, funny thing, I thought today, because I was watching a series with uh, Kathy Bates in it, quite interesting actor, because she has like very different complex roles. I didn't notice, notice her. Like, if you look at Hollywood, you basically look at the uh, pretty faces and stuff like that. But you also need, like, uh, so it might sound harsh or rude, like an insult. But sometimes you need not ugly people, but people that don't look perfect, you know, picture perfect. And uh, Kathy Bates, she found, like, her role and her niche, sort of, because of this. And uh, she has, like, roles where she's, like, a helpful mother or a scary butcher or stuff like this. But it boils down to this. Uh, she has, like, diverse roles and castings and, uh, like, most every movie. Most of the movies I've seen her are not so bad. So either she read the script stuff or... Today I try something new. Oh, try taking an alternative route, or uh, she's just lucky, 
but uh, I seriously admire her for that because when you see like uh, an actor having many good roles and also as a non-actor <laughs> it looks to me like yeah acting I could do that it's always very funny there are two kinds of people when they see a profession the ones that think I could never do that and then there are the other ones and they say like uh, yeah I can do the like blindfolded with one hand and uh, acting per se certain aspects are not that difficult I mean you could like get into the role Let's say you're playing in hobo, so you uh, kind of really become a hobo in order to get the feel for your role that you're playing. But is it really necessary? Are you becoming more of an actor? Is it just about uh, for you getting the Grammys, or is it basically the fame or whatnot? You know, at the end of the day, nobody who really care about this stuff is harsh and brutal and painful as it might sound. I'm parking on the fucking line. And, uh, yeah. So, uh, and uh, what I wanted to get back is, um, see actors act like uh, rude assholes you know, in their scenes it's uh, kind of part of this whole thing and anyway, what I think is quite funny is like uh, in real life when you tell somebody like uh, you're a fat stupid piece of shit you know and you say it without a certain context especially with your best friends like most of the time you say stuff like, yeah, I was joking, man. I'm just kidding, man. Don't take it serious. But uh, in acting, you can, like, progress this uh, momentum, you know? Like, you can act like somebody, you think somebody's an asshole. It's just part of the act. I love this, you know? The joke doesn't have to be explained. Like, you're going with it. Especially if you don't know, is it a joke or is it not a joke? And I like this style more. Yeah. So, uh, I arrived at my destination, and that's it. Let's stop the recording. Is it even still recording? Yeah. Um, oh. Hello. <laughs>